Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. You can sync the SharePoint folders for the files for channels and teams in Teams to a local folder on your computer by using OneDrive so you can access and edit local copies of these files even offline. Since you sync to the folders when you connect online, changes you or others make to the files in these folders update automatically. Note that you must be using the most updated version of the OneDrive app to be able to sync files to your local device. The first step is to select which SharePoint folder to sync with your local folder. To sync the folder of a specific team channel, select the team in Teams, select the channel, and then click the Files tab at the top of the channel. Alternatively, to sync all team channels except private channels, Select the team in Teams, select its General Channel, click its Files tab, and then click the Open in SharePoint button. Then log in with your Microsoft 365 credentials if prompted in the web browser that opens. Within the SharePoint site, then click the Documents link at the left side of the window. Doing this should then show all the channels for the team in a list to the right. After selecting the desired folder location in either Teams or in SharePoint, then click the Sync button in the toolbar at the top of the list of files and folders to set up the folder sync. If syncing for the first time, you may need to sign into the OneDrive app on your device. Next, the Your OneDrive Folder dialog box shows the local folder on your computer where the files from the selected SharePoint folder will be synced in OneDrive. If needed, you can click the Change Location link at the bottom of the window to select a different local OneDrive folder by navigating to its location, clicking to select it, and then clicking the Select Folder button. Then click through the informational screens that appear, and then click the Open My OneDrive Folder button at the end. The selected folder on your computer then opens in File Explorer. You can then click to close any informational windows opened in SharePoint or Teams if needed. After successfully completing the sync, you can easily access the files either on your computer or in SharePoint. If desired, to manually sync files for a synced folder in Teams or in SharePoint, click the Sync button in the Files toolbar when viewing the synced folder in Teams or SharePoint again. To access the locally synced copies, directly navigate to the synced folder's location on your computer by using File Explorer. To stop syncing a folder in OneDrive, click the OneDrive icon in your Windows taskbar, click the Help and Settings button, and then select the Settings command. On the Account tab of the Microsoft OneDrive dialog box that opens, Click the Stop Sync link next to the folder for which to disable syncing. Then click the Stop Sync button. When finished, click the OK button. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.